Hello everybody, it's Caitlin here. Today I am making a rosemary mint soap and it's going to be colored with some green mica from Two Girls Micas and the fragrance is from Nurture Soap. Alrighty, so first thing I'm going to do is combine my uh, coconut milk powder with my soft oils. And these are olive oil um, castor oil, apricot kernel, and jojoba oil. Just to make sure that's dispersed nicely and it could kind of soak in a little better while I'm mixing up the other stuff. Okay, and then in my container here, I have my hot lye solution and this has some citric acid dissolved in it and some mulberry silk and I'm going to be pouring that into um, my hard oils and butters here and just in case I have any larger chunks of anything I strained it okay and I really have to do soaping dishes, so I'm kind of using my backup soaping supplies here. <laughs> um, my little spatula. I have a larger one, but I just it's not my favorite to use. Alrighty, so I'm going to let this melt down. It usually takes about five minutes. Um, and then I will bring you guys back once this is all melted. Okay, so I'm checking the temperature here, and it's 121 degrees, and then the temperature after I add my soft oils, we'll check that. And I'm just going to hand stir it for a second, and then I will give you that temperature reading. So the last one was 121 degrees. And let's see what it is now with so it dropped to a hundred and well it's going down dropped to 109 degrees so it went from 121 to 109 so this technically is still soaping really warm because um, it is warm up in my soaping room, and my hard oils and butters were already pretty soft. Um, so there wasn't too much to melt. <laughs> they were starting to melt on their own. So I'm just going to get this to emulsion. And it does not take very long with these small batches. The problem with a lot of people is that they overblend from the very beginning. And by a lot of people, I mean me. <laughs> That's usually my problem. And I'm just checking to make sure it's not separating on the stick blender here. And it's not. And so I'm going to actually split this off now into three different containers. that into my first container here which I just got these they're, they're just like a stack of cups I got them from Dollar Tree so I'm gonna go down I'm gonna pour my fragrance in and this like I said is the rosemary mint try not to make a big mess <laughs> but I am I am making a mess Okay, so there's the rosemary mint fragrance. And then for the first layer, I think I'm gonna do Envy. And like I said, these are from Two Girls Micas. So let me get my scoop of Envy. 
and I'm just going to do a healthy amount. And this has, it's green, like a lime green with a hint of gold in it. Very pretty. And I kind of want this to set up pretty quickly because it's going to be a layered soap. This one is Envy. Isn't that just beautiful? You could see little gold specks in it. Ah, very pretty. And I just want a layered soap. And I might save some of this for the very top. Yeah, that's what I'll do. I'm gonna bang this down. And then in my next bowl, I am going to be adding my fragrance. Okay. And I'm going to be adding Leprechaun. And Leprechaun is a nice tealy green. And this one also has like a sparkle to it. It might have been too much. We will see. And you know what? I'm just going to stick blend it. Ooh. This is such a pretty, pretty color, Mica. How gorgeous. That is so pretty. That is beautiful. This smells so good too. It's so refreshing. I love a rosemary mint fragrance. And this one is by far my favorite nurture soap. Their fragrances are great quality. And I don't know if you could see this. But there is a nice, like, silvery shimmer to this. This is messy. It's hard to pour this because of the, um, there's no handle. Makes it a little bit more difficult to pour. Sorry if I'm breathing really deeply into my microphone here. That's just me breathing. <laughs> All right, I'm going to save the rest for the top. Okay, now I'm going to bang this down. I'm going to add the rest of the fragrance. Poifik. And I'm adding fresh cut grass. So this is a yellow green. If I can open it. It's always hard to open packages when you're wearing gloves. Okay, I could do it. I did it. Woo! All right. I'm gonna be pretty generous with this just because it is a lighter, a lighter green. And let's get it down in there. Okay. This is such a pretty lime green. Isn't that gorgeous? It does look like a nice bright grass color. Look at how pretty this is. Oh, I don't even know if you could tell how gorgeous this is. Or if you could see like 
the beautiful green color that it is. Oh, but it's so pretty. It's so like shimmery. It's beautiful shimmery green. I am obsessed with it. Now I don't know if anything broke through and that is no problem. And this might morph a little bit and then go back, um, you know, once it, uh, you know, saponifies. I'm going to add some fun pizzazz. Making a mess. Making messes. That's what I do. I love this leprechaun color. It's like oh, so pretty. Alrighty, and this is the top. Now hopefully that last color will go back to the beautiful green that it was. Otherwise, it's going to be more of a pea colored green. Like the, um, you know, like a pea, the food. <laughs> but anyways... That is it guys and I will bring you guys back for the cut. Okay, I am back for the cut. It's about like 22 hours later and it unmolded kind of sticky like so it's a little soft still. Um, but yeah, if you hear any barking, my dogs are outside and if you hear any screaming, crying, or yelling. <laughs> I just put my son down for his nap. So he may or may not hear me in here making noise. So we'll see. There it is. I don't know if you could see the slight shimmer that some of the mica has. That top is really fun. It's kind of unexpected because this is such like a neat design and it's like chaos <laughs> on top. And the green did go back to a brighter green. It's still not, I think when it's up against these other two, it looks a little bit off but it's fine it like I said it's more of a yellow a yellowy green but I would have loved well actually these all look really nice together and it, it didn't turn out to be that pea green that was like baby diaper green <laughs> And this fragrance smells so good. It's a really pretty fragrance. Ooh. 
and they all pretty much look the same. That is it. I am going to let these probably sit for a couple of days before I uh, plane and bevel them just because they are a little tacky and I don't want the soap smearing around. Um, so my son just came upstairs. Mommy. Yep. You got to get me another set of headphones. Or games. Oh. Alrighty. Um, and. For Minecraft. Oh, for Minecraft? Yeah. Okay. So I'm not going to have a picture inserted because I want to let this sit for a couple of days. But this is pretty much what it's going to look like. Alrighty. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye.